Hey people, and welcome to the Yu-Gi-Oh! Tier Draft League. Yes, I have made a Yu-Gi-Oh! League with my co-host, Stanzi87. So you guys know how you're not getting videos from me during the weekend. Well, now you are, because you will be getting these matches, these league videos during the weekend. Yes, that's right. Two videos on Saturday, two videos on Sunday, getting that content. Without further ado, let me introduce the teams. So here are your eight teams. We have the Yugi Dark Magicians. Hey, I'm Kippa. I am the captain of the uh, Yugi Dark Magicians. The Kaiba White Dragons. What's good, guys? It's Brian from Team Ninja, representing the Kaiba White Dragons. The Yuma Utopians. I'm Paolo from Pasquale Tala Luna Network, the next big man trying to go for 10,000 wins on the end, and I'm representing the Utopias. The Zane Cyber. Hello, Great Warrior here, and I'm the captain of the main Cyber Dragon. You say Star Dragons. Hi, my name is Omar Kios, and I'm the captain of You Say Star Dragon. The Jack Red Arch Fiends. Hi, this is Stu Dog, and I'm captain of the Jack Red Arch Fiends. The Kite Galaxy Photons. Hello, I'm Luna, and I am captain of the Galaxy Photons. The Yuya Pendulum Dragon. What's up, everyone? My name is Mal of the West. Mal of every direction, but I like the West more because I'm in the West Hemisphere, so of course I like the West. Now I'll be representing Yuya's Pendulum Dragons. So, for the uh, tier point system, what we decided to do was, rather than doing a system which would mean everyone would use a tier 1 deck all the time and we would have no variety, we decided to impl implement a point system into it to give all the people participating more incentive into using a lower tier deck versus a higher tier deck. So, the point system works as follows. If a tier 1 deck beats another tier 1 deck, then the winning tier 1 deck would get 1 point. If a tier 1 deck beats a tier 2 or 3 deck, then again, the winning tier 1 deck would get 1 point. If a tier 2 deck beats a tier 1 deck, then the winning tier 2 deck would get 2 points, and if the tier 2 deck beats a tier 2 or a tier 3 deck, then the winning deck would get 1 point. With tier 3, it's the same in principle. If a tier 3 deck beats a tier 1 deck, then the tier 3 deck gets 3 points. If a tier 3 deck beats a tier 2 deck, then the tier 3 deck gets 2 points. And if a tier 3 deck beats another tier 3 deck, then you get 1 point. And of course, if you lose, no points are given to the losing deck. So you get nothing! You lose! Good day, sir! All right, so let's quickly go over some rules and regulations set in place for both you, the viewers, and the team so we clear up any misunderstandings. So starting it off, we are playing on the April 2015 TCG ban list, so despite if there's any updates to the ban list from Konami, we are using April 2015 TCG ban list. Rule number two, no OCG cards are allowed unless stated otherwise. There are some decks that are allowed OCG cards and there's some decks that aren't. So. Uh, before you guys go ahead and suggest, you know, some OCG cards for some decks, just know, unless stated otherwise, OCG cards are not allowed. Rule number three, decks may not be used twice in a row. So to go ahead and implement kind of like a system where you can strategize against your opponent, you, if, you, if one of the teams uses a deck one week, they may not use that same deck next week. They have to choose one of the two different decks, which allows the opponent to strategize and think which one of their two decks they want to go ahead and send out and use. And last but not least, the final rule. Once the decks are finalized and approved, there will be no alteration. So, yes, you guys, I know you guys totally want to go ahead and in the comment section below make suggestions and, you know, attempt to help out the teams that you guys are supporting, but for right now, we're going to go ahead and set this regulation just to make sure that the decks are set in place and that there's not a lot of changing and cheating. So, uh, if you guys have any questions, go ahead and comment them in the comment section below. So, I hope that you guys are ready for the Yu-Gi-Oh! Tier Draft League. Coming up, we will be doing the draft. So stay tuned. All right, people. So here is the draft. So we have all eight teams here. We're going to randomize it and uh, pretty much the order that they are, we're going to go down the list. They pick their tier one decks and we're going to go back up the list to pick their tier two decks. And then we're going to come back to the randomizer and randomize it again. And then they're going to go ahead and announce their tier three decks. So we're going to go ahead and click the randomizer and see the order. All right. So 
Starting it off, the first choice is the Yugi Dark Magician, followed by the Jack Red Archeans, then the Kai Galaxy Photons, followed by the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, then the Kaiba White Dragons, then the Yuma Utopias, the Yusei Star Dragons, and ending it off with the Zane Cyber Dragons. Alright people, we are starting the draft. So we went ahead and randomized the teams and now we are going to have the team captains go ahead and start off and pick up their tier 1 deck. So Stanzi, what is the first team to pick their tier 1 the deck? First, the first team is the Yugi Dark Magicians. Who All right. is... All right. oh. So Yugi Dark Magicians? Who is... Okay, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll take um, Mermail. Alright, so... The first choice, Yugi, Dark Magicians, chose Mermel. All right, so uh, why did you pick Mermel? Uh, I've just been meaning to try the Mermels. Finally gives me a reason to finally try it. All right, all right, all right, cool. All right, so the second team to go ahead and choose is the... Jack Red Arch Fiends. Oh, yeah. All right, so which tier one deck do you choose? Uh, Burning Abyss. Burning Abyss, alright. Alright, nice. Alright, and why did you turn choose Burning Abyss? Because it's one of the most successful with what I think. Well, I don't know what the band this is, but it's what I'm planning on making in real life. Well, it's going to be the April list regardless. Yeah, so yeah it's the April it list It doesn't regardless. matter. Yeah. Oh, okay. Alright. Yeah. Alright, so, thank you. Alright, moving on. The third choice? Is the Kite Galaxy Photon. Thirteen. Uh, I'll take. I'll play. Clown Blade. Clown Blade. All right. All right. So that's Kite. And why did you choose Clown Blade? Because Momo was stolen from me. <laughs> 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 All right. All right. That, that's a pretty good choice. So uh, well, when it comes to Clown Blade, it pretty much has the Clown Blade engine, and you can use any uh, other archetype with the Clown Blade as long as it doesn't. Uh, have any of the other tier one decks in it. So if you want to use in powered infinity, clown blade. Though, yeah. Yeah, you, you get you get infinity. Clown blade. That's all that matters. Yep. Alright. Alright. So uh number four. Alright, number four is the Yuya Pendulum Dragons. I'm going with them odd eyes magicians. Oh right. damn. Yeah, alright. Kind of fitting. Uh, <laughs> that's kind of fitting. <laughs> that yeah, is. it is. <laughs> all right, so it's, I guess it's pretty obvious why you're choosing it, but... Uh... Of course. All right, so good luck. All right. And then so... black and white waves. Oh, all right, number five? Number five is the Kaiba White Dragons. Klebola! <laughs> all right. <laughs> so you do get the, the, the wavering eyes and all that good stuff, so... Hells yeah, so hello, please. That. All right, uh, number six. The Yuma Utopias. The clay's been taken on that. Yes, they yeah, have been taken. Yeah, just been taken. Let's see, I'll take Necros. Not about to say. Necros, all right. I will no say, vision. someone, will well, someone pick, <laughs> no one yeah, pick Necros. Yeah, Necros, no one wants them. All right. Well, like, no, I'm a Necros player, Necros. All right, just no Degen in your belt. Yep, yeah, no, no DJ. Yeah, I won't. Alright. Alright, cool. Alright, seven? Alright, is the Yusei Star Dragons. Hmm, I pick Satara Knights. Alright. Alright, Satara Knights. Satara Knights? Alright, and why'd you pick Satara Knights? Because it's the only thing that's really left. <laughs> yeah, because it can be played as a rank up based deck, pretty much. Yep. Alright, and uh, number eight? Is the Zane Cyber Dragons? Uh, I got heroes. All right. So damn, no no love for the Shadals. <laughs> no love for the Shadals. All right. Wow. So there are your choices for the tier one decks, and the there's a, actually a YCS tier and a regional tier that will be breaking down after the end of this uh, a draft and uh, separated accordingly. So uh, now since we got the tier ones, let's move on to the tier twos. So same order, we randomize them again. Backwards. All right, backwards. Okay. All right. So you ready, Rico? Yep. All right. So now we are tier two, and we're going to go back up the list in reverse order. So starting it off, uh, number one. The Zane Cyber Dragons. Which one? Which one, Zane? 
I'm, I'm, Which one I'm, out of those tier two things do you want? I'm thinking, actually. Jeez. <laughs> no, we're not um, rushing. Alright. <sighs> <around. sighs> Should I go with the best deck or the one that I'm the most comfortable with? You do um, whatever you want. Whatever you want. Yeah, I think I'll Light go poke. with Black Wings. All right. All right. I, I think so. Heroes and Black Wings. Black Wings. Okay. <laughs> wow. Stewie's uh, mad as Harry. All right. So, uh, number two. All right. So number two is the Yusei Star Dragons. Um, I pick Ritual Beast. Yeah, right. I figured you would, Omega. <laughs> as soon as I saw that, I'm like, yep, that's Omega, right there, Ritual Beast, right there. Alright, so, number three? Uh, number three is... the Yuma Utopias. Hmm... Light Swarm. That's not a choice. That's not a choice, you're choosing out of the uh, list in that. Which one, tier one or...? Tier two. Tier two list. You've already chosen your tier one deck. Yeah, I mean, if you want Lightsworn to be your tier three, just make sure no one takes it first. Yeah, it's put tier three. Um, like, um, well, no, no. Well, it'll have to when it gets to your turn again. Oh, okay. Hmm. Let's see. Have a, do mute um, your mic, please. Chaos Dragon. That is not. Look, one. look at the tier two list. Look at the list in the chat. I'm looking at the list right now and the air. It's the one that says Ritual Beast, Trains, OCG, Yosenju, Volcanic, Evil Swarms, Harpies, Infernoid, Fire Fist, or Black Wings. Ritual Beast and Black Wings have already been taken. Oh, hold on. This the... Oh, sorry about it. Um, Volcanics. Okay. Volcanics, alrighty. What was that, Yuma? Sorry about it, it just... Uh, that was the Yuma that. Utopias, yeah. Alright. It's alright. So... We got there in the end. <laughs> number four? Number four is the Kaiba White Dragon. Alright, I'm gonna go with Infernoids on my end. Alright. Alright, Infernoids. Alright, uh, number five? Uh, I'm gonna go with the... Evil Swarms. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, do you your Pendulum Dragons? Okay. Kyle, there we are. <laughs> Alright, right. so you get and take Evil Swarms. Alright, and what are we now? Number six? Yep, uh, so that is the Kite Galaxy Photons. Yes, send you! Alright. All right. So happy my first pick wasn't taken. Alright. <laughs> and uh, number seven? Alright, number seven is the Jack Red Arch Fiends. Okay, what's left? Uh, Fire Fist, Harpies, and Trains. Um, Fire Fist. Alright. Alright. <laughs> and that was Jack, right? Yeah. That was the Jack Red Arch Fiends. So last up is the Yugi Dark Magician. I guess I'll take trains since your singes were stolen. <laughs> hey, that's the thing. You got to choose that's your tier one goes. first. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. You stole my mermaids. I'm taking your your singes. Damn right. Get that revenge in. All right. So now we so have our. I guess it's worth a try. Uh -huh. All right. So now we have our tier ones and we have our tier two. So we're gonna go ahead and put them in the randomizer again, and everybody will choose their tier threes, which is where they get creative and actually choose one that's not on the list. So, uh, be right back. All right, we are back on randomizer, so we're gonna hit the randomize button again, and this will decide the order in which they choose their tier three deck. So let's go ahead and hit randomize. All right, starting it off, it's the Yusei Star Dragon, followed by the Yuya Pendulum Dragon, then the Zane Cyber Dragon, the Kite Galaxy Photons, the Yugi Dark Magicians, the Yuma Utopians, the Jack Red Archfiends, and the Kaiba White Dragon. All right, so we are back with the tier three, so. They pretty much just to go ahead and pick a tier 3 deck, which may not be tier 3, uh, it's just one of the decks that's not on the tier 1 or tier 2 list that they want as their tier 3 deck. So starting it off, which team? Is the Yusei Star Dragons. And for my tier 3 deck, I choose Heraldic Beast. Alright, so Heraldic Beast. Not Raid Raptors, I'm, I'm shocked. I'm actually surprised. <laughs> Damn, alright, right. Uh, not Raid Raptors, <laughs> Heraldic Beast, I know you said Raid Raptors. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, uh, team two? All right, team two is the Yuya Pendulum Dragons. I want to use Evos. All right. All right, Evos. Evos. All right, so, uh, team number three? Team number three is the Zane Cyber Dragons. Dustin. 
All right. Dustin, All right. interesting. That's choice. an interesting choice. Yep. All right, team number four. Team number four is the Kite Galaxy Photons. Despots. Oh, no, wait, Despot. wait, no, no, wait, wait. It's no OCG, it's no OCG. Yep, no OCG. No OCG, no. Let me change my mind. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um... <laughs> I was not prepared. I gave you a list. I know, I know, it's my fault. I was busy making art, you know. <laughs> uh, um, God. Madolche. You You're gonna go with what? Madolche. 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 All right. Interesting. Interesting. All right. So, team number five. All right. So, team number five is the Yugi Dark Magicians. Uh, I guess I'll go with Raid Raptors. Is Raid Raptors TCG or is that OCG? Uh, so it's TCG, it's but TCG, but most of the main cards are still OCG. So, yeah. if you want to, you'd be playing a very fucked up. Oh, uh, we'll with... give we'll give you Strix. We'll give you Strix. Yeah, we'll give you Strix. I'll I'll go with Plant. Then. Uh, well, it has to be an archetype. It can't well, be well, well, like Sylvans or Sylvans or like Synchro Plant Plants or so, yeah. Plant Princess, not Synchro Plants, because that's not an archetype. I guess I'll go with Sylvans. All right, All right. Sylvans, interesting. All right, and I forgot what number we're on. Six. We are on number six, <laughs> and it's the Human Utopias. Light swarms. Light swarms. Oh, oh right. actually, I have to change this. Wow, I'm so bad. You my utopians. <laughs> Alright, light horns. Alright, got that. And uh number seven? The Jack Red Arch Fiends. Who is is that Stu? Wait, Stu. Lost? We lost Stu. We lost uh, Stu. We lost Yeah, we lost Stu. Wow, alright. Well thank He's you. You've been Stu. lost into the void. Oh, thank you, Stu. Oh my god. I'm thinking about you want to just give him a random deck for a punishment for not being here? Well he's not it's not <laughs> that he isn't here, he's here. He's <laughs> just he's he just he fell off the call. Here he is. He is. Stu, oh, are you back? My now? Turn. Yeah. yeah, it's yeah. your turn. What's your tier three deck, man? Uh worms. What? Always worms. Oh worms. worms. Alright. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I'll be interesting. <laughs> Worms versus Tier One to get the most points. I'll be an interesting one. <laughs> All right, and last but not least is the Kaiba White Dragon. All right. Yep. I'm kind of on the side between either between Noble Knights and Constellers. You know, Noble Knights are slacky, and that's not allowed. So you want to go with Constellers? Oh yeah, it's not allowed. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. You, you know, let's represent the stars on this one. We're going Constellers. All right. All right. Stellars. Interesting. Oh, yeah. All right, there we go. We have all three decks, so I'm not gonna list them because I can't remember which team has which deck. So I will put them in the description below. You can go ahead and check it out. So there we go. There is the draft. Uh, we will try to start this as soon as possible. Uh, we already have uh, which matches will be lined up each week. So if you want to see uh, each week's match, that will also be there's a link in the description. Go ahead and click that, and it'll take you to a link which will give you all the uh, opponents each week. So it is like a round robin system. Everybody will be doing every, dueling. I said doing, dueling everybody. Damn. <laughs> everybody that's doing that. everybody. Yes, <laughs> the OG is here. Let it commence. Yes. Everybody will be dueling I'll everybody. I'll get the fish. Hang on. And uh, coming up, I will go ahead and break it down the, the divisions and uh, explain how that system will work. All right, people. So there you go. There's your draft. So now since the draft is over, I can now introduce the division system. So to make sure that the top upper tier 1 decks don't just completely demolish the lower tier 1 deck, I have split the 8 teams into two divisions. So starting off with the upper division, or the YCS division, we have the Yuma Utopians, the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, the Kite Galaxy Photons, and the Kaiba White Dragons. And in the regional division, or the lower division, we have the Yusei Star Dragons. The Yugi Dark Magician, the Jack Red Archfiends, and the Zane Fighting Dragon. Alright, so the way that this division system is going to work is that this meet is a round robin, so everybody will be dueling against everybody. And at the end of the regular season, the team with the lowest amount of points will get dropped. 
The team at the top of the division will get a bye week. The two middle teams will duel each other in a playoff sort of duel to determine who will duel against the top deck for the divisional champion. And of course, the final, the world championship, will be the YCS division champion versus the regional division champion. All right, so that is pretty much it. This wraps up the introduction and the draft of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Tier Draft League. So please, please show your support by liking this video and liking all the videos. And uh, go ahead and show your support. Favorite it, this video. Share it with your friends. Share it with, you know, your family. And, you know, let's spread the word about this awesome thing that we are preparing to do. So, of course, with the changes to my channel, you guys do not get any videos during the weekend, which sucks. But now, with this league, I promise you that I will give you four videos during the weekend. One for each round of the tournament. Each match of the round, of course. So, uh, there's eight teams. That means there'll be four duels. Uh, you will get two on Saturday, two on Sunday. And we will keep on going along until this season is over. So if you guys are super hyped, make sure you hit that like button. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Favorite this video, share it with your friends, share it with your family, and let's spread the word about this awesome idea, this fun event. I hope that you guys are excited for it. And uh, yeah, thanks for all the support.